students welcome to the seventh part of plant kingdom this is the last part under this chapter in this part we will be discussing about the plant life cycles plant kingdom plant life cycles so uh, what is a general plant life cycle if we take a look at general life plants plant life cycle then it will be like a seed is there okay this seed will give rise to a seedling through the process of germination and this seedling will in turn give rise to a plant this plant will give flowers and after flowers what we get we again in turn get seeds so this is a life cycle in which uh, we get the same things again and again so this is a general plant life cycle and in uh, we have basically three types of life cycles first one is the haplontic life cycle second one is the diplontic life cycle and third one is the haplodiplontic life cycle what is the uh, what is a haplontic life cycle if the major dominant phase is haploid and if the dominant phase is major dominant phase is diploid then it will be called diplontic life cycle and if in both the uh, things will alternate whether or you can say this this will be a 50 50 percent of haploid and uh, diploid so it will be called as haplodiplontic life cycle so let's have a look at the haplontic life cycle